The monsoon can produce some amazing lightning shows. But the power of lightning is nothing to take for granted. We have seen it start massive fires, knock out power to thousands, and even deadly in many cases. Not in your sides, Christina Myers met with a man today whose house was hit by lightning just over the weekend. That's right, Guy Stella. Fortunately, he and his daughter were not hurt by the bolt. But the event, unexpected and frightening, had the man uncertain as to what to do. So Nine on Your Side wanted to find out exactly what you should do if your house is ever hit by lightning. Loudest crack I've probably heard. It was, yeah, like a, a rifle or a gun going off right next to your ear. Very, very, very loud. J.R. Shanks was watching Sunday's storm rip through his east side neighborhood. Then it just hit. It was a white flash. All I saw was white, and, and I could feel it in my chest, a little bit of pressure, and then I just slammed the door shut. The lightning frying his TV and blowing out four breakers, but luckily leaving no other damage. Tucson Fire Department Public Information Officer Barrett Baker says what you need to do is look for charring on walls, listen for any kind of popping or buzzing coming from electric appliances, and of course, keep an eye out for any smoke or flames. Then immediately call 911 from your cell phone. We try to pinpoint the location as to where the strike happened, and more than anything else, we obviously want to make sure that something that is very small doesn't grow into something larger. Even though Jay JR didn't have to call police. He says the experience changed the way he sees monsoon. Got me a little bit on edge this summer, definitely. I was a little worried. I unplugged a bunch more stuff in my house, ran around and unplugged the other TVs and stuff. Now, whenever there is lightning in your area, unplug as many appliances as you can. That will actually decrease the paths that the lightning can take through your house. Also, do not shower or bathe during a lightning storm because it can travel through the pipes as well. Live in the newsroom, Christina Myers, KGA 9, on your side. Christina, thank you.